Hey guys, welcome back. Thanks for tuning in again today. Um, just going to be a real quick video. Um, 300 wind mag at a thousand meters. Um, the idea of this one is just to try and fine tune or get the best picture quality and shooting I can out of the um, trigger cam. So um, this is my 300 wind mag. I have done a few videos on these. Um, I've just had it sericoated in McMillan tan, so the whole chassis, uh, whole chassis uh, barrel action, everything possible. So. Um, added the night force attacker up top here so and this is what we'll be looking through today as well so I'll we'll just um, I have sighted this in today at 100 meters so we'll just go straight down the back um, I haven't shot down there today let's go straight down the back to a thousand and um, see how we go hit indicators down there I've just set that up um, so I'll just shift this around I might just leave it there and um, yeah we'll do the shooting down the back so. See if I can arrange it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he has an four. Turn this out. I'll just start the trigger cam. Yep, it's running. So a thousand meters with this gun, 190 grain federal premium ammo. Um, so I think seven and a half mils at a thousand meters. Temperature is about 30 degrees. Wind's going left to right. Let's send one and see if we can see where it lands. I'll give it 0.5 left. Blowing pretty heavy. Seven and a half mils. 1000 meters, 300 wind mag. See this land. That's a hit. Windage is perfect. Give it another one. Top left. It's got five rounds loaded up too, guys. Top right. Try for a headshot. Headshot, thousand meters. Probably one over. Alright guys, that's um, 
just a quick little video on the trigger cam. It seemed to be working, everything was working great, so hopefully the picture comes out the same on, on the video that I'll do up later. Um, but yeah, a bit more detail about the rifle guys. I, as I said, I have done videos on this before, but 40 MOA ra uh, rail on it, 5 round Acumad magazine, um, badge ordnance, um, bottom metal there, um, Macmillan A5 stock, Harris, uh, not a Harris, uh, Atlas bipod up the front, and then we've got the um, badge ordnance muzzle brake as well. So, uh, chamber and trend wind mag as mentioned. So, yeah, Timney trigger as well in this. Um, it is a very accurate rifle guys, especially with that MO. Um, I was shooting that 25 power there as well, um, just because we try and get the best picture for this tricky cam. I don't normally shoot at that much power, especially at a thousand meters, but look for this picture, um, this video, that was that was the whole idea of it. So uh, Four hits out of five, I did try and go for a headshot at a thousand meters, but um, I dare say it probably went over, so um, all left or right of it. 100% sure on that, but it's alright. Um, but anyway, hope you enjoyed this one, guys. Just yeah, just quick little video. Um, stay tuned. I will be getting another rifle built very shortly, so this one will be a 65 Creedmoor and a custom MDT chassis. So just wait for the barrel to get done, and um, I'll do a video on that as soon as I get it. So stay tuned and hang around for that one. All right, catch you next time.